Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at running Mattermost, a secure collaboration platform in Docker. To begin, connect to the device where we're going to install Docker. We'll start by using apt install to install a few prerequisite packages required to run Docker. Then we'll add the Docker GPG key and apt repository. Next, we'll use apt install to install docker, docker compose, and container d. With the docker packages installed, we'll make sure the docker service is started and enabled. Add the current user to the docker group, then re-authenticate the current user for the group change to take effect. We're now ready to start running containers. We'll start by using the git clone command to pull the mattermost docker compose files from github. Then using the make dir command, we'll create a series of working directories for the Mattermost container to use. We'll use the cp command to create a copy of the example.m file. Then we'll set ownership of the new working directory structure, and set the permissions so the docker container can write to it. We'll use regular expression to replace the default volumes in the m file, then we'll edit it in nano. Update the .m file as needed making sure to change the domain, time zone, Postgres user and password. Once completed, save your changes and close out of Nano. Back in the terminal, we'll cd to the root of the Mattermost working directory structure. Then we'll use the docker compose up command to create our containers. Once the containers are up and running, open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the Docker host, colon 8065. Click the View in Browser button. Create an account by entering an email address, username, and password. Then click the Create Account button. Enter an organization name. Then select the tools that you use, or click Skip. And finally, click Finish Setup. Welcome to Mattermost, running containerized in Docker. 